to work on somebody who is same sided as you. The reason why is because the side that I'm going to attack is right here. If you stand in the other direction, it just it goes. I don't I don't throw in this direction, and I'd have to like switch my stance up. So. Since most people stand with their right foot forward, this, this works really well for me. So I don't want to let them know what I'm doing. So I'm just trying to come out here, trying to make them think that I really want this arm very badly. They'll do whatever. I don't care if they pull out. I'm trying to get, this is what I want. I want them to feel like I'm going to grab your neck, you grab my neck. And now they feel like this is a 50-50 situation. I don't really care what he does here as long as I can have a nice lock here. So I'm going to take my, my forearm and I'm going to chop right here in his, in his elbow joint. At the same time, I'm bringing his elbow in, making it uncomfortable for him. I want to make sure that, that he doubles down on his grip here because I'm going to need that as soon as I turn. So I push in. He doesn't like that. He starts resisting. So that is what I'm going to use to take my first step. I chop in. He resists. I come in here and I get my grip. So we're here. I call his resistance. Come in here, grab, and then turn and throw. So from the beginning, And now, if he does try to take my back, I have full control over this arm. I'm going out like this. I'm trying to do spark hold. 